Hi guys, and welcome back to the allotment. Oh my God, how great does my hair look? Well, yeah, we'll gloss over that. Right, I'm getting old. All right, we're here to do watering. Oh. Spider web. Spider web again. <coughs> That's what I keep this here for, so I can just... There you go, no spider web now. Ugh. Right. <laughs> oh, I might have a bit of heat stroke today. Um, very warm. 31 degrees it was at the race course today. And, oh dear. Not a lot of water left in my butts now. So what we're going to do, we're going to put you all the way up there. And I'm going to, ow! Bloody stinging nettle. And I'm going to stretch over. So when my phone falls off. Right. That wasn't that easy. Oh my God. Right. So, yes, we're here to do the watering, but I have noticed something that is annoying me. So we are going to go and sort it out. Because why, why wouldn't you? Hmm? Seriously, why wouldn't you? So we'll get this done. Let me just put that down. Yay. <laughs> That's other members of the allotment recognising me. That's a scary thought, people recognising me. Right, we've left my allotment because we're coming in here. This, <laughs> duck to get in. This is Natalie and Troy's and uh, their tomatoes are doing really, really well. Cucumber, not so well, but they're also very dry. So, and water, oh God, water is at a premium at the moment. So, oh, sorry, Mr. Spider, I didn't see you there. So we are going to uh, help as much as we can by filling oh, their baths for them. And hopefully, because it's supposed to be really warm this weekend as well. So hopefully, their tomatoes won't die. So, oh, missed one. Put this one down here, look. Can you see that? Just this one here. So, yeah, that bit of water as well. And obviously, that was a tight spin. As we all know, it's better to water the tomatoes from the bottom if you can. Unless you're me. And then, well, you do what you want. All right, so there you go. There's my good deed done for the week. And it is Friday. Friday the... Find out what bloody day it is. I know it's Friday. That's all I know. Friday the 8th of September at quarter to seven in the afternoon and it's still bloody hot 29 degrees when I got out the car so we are oh god I'm gonna to have to go get more water now all right one sec I just need to remove fox protection get, get off there all right shall we flip you around so it's a bit easier for me because you've you've had enough of looking at my face now haven't you yeah Right, so I've popped off and I've grabbed some more water. Look, I've got water for you. And it has been ridiculously warm in England. Oh, we don't do, we don't do warmth in England very well. Although it does still look quite moist in here. Oh, that's a lovely shot, isn't it? It's, have some minging old leaves. Um, all right, let's get back to that money maker. Oh my God. So it's really hard doing one-handed, you know, because this, this is a 10 litre... Oh, God, that's really hurt my arm. Is this a 10 litre one? I can't remember what size. Yes, it, yes, 10 litre watering can. And I'm feeling every litre at the moment. So we'll make sure everything has a good drink, because like I say, it has been very, 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 very hot. I mean, like, and tanned. And Englishman. Let's not go there. Right. Let's get. Blub, 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 blub. These are the new tomatoes, and they are doing really bloody well. Um. Let's just park that there a minute. Um. We have. Um. Was the best? Ah, oh, there they are. 
Right, there you go. We have baby tomatoes. But not just on one, we have them on a couple. There's one right at the back there. And they're coming through. Um, I'm guessing by the shape of this, this is the Marzano ones. <laughs> kind of tell really, can't you, because of the shape of them. This, yeah, oh, the bloody camera. Right, that's uh, the, another leaf touching my stop button. So I've got to remember that. So where did I get to? That was right, the, the, let's go over the top. That little fella right in the back there is my first Marzano. Um, the two money makers are doing really well. The one at the back, I'm trying not to turn the camera off this time. Look, we've got tomatoes still, so some of those will be coming home with me. The uh, black Russian at the back seems to be going mental, so I need to sort that out. Maybe quite a bit of uh, pruning going on there. All right, oh, look, we've got more flowers, but I don't really want... Because I've got the outside ones, which are doing better, so I might just cut that down, let them grow, and that'll be it for that plant. The same with the Tigerella. Once I get these off, then that's it. And that's the end of this plant. I'm just going to chop it off, get rid of it. Um, not just because I need the room in here, but I do. Um, right. Let's go all the way down to the Buena Malata because it's just fabulous. Lovely colour to these. I believe you're supposed to wait until they're red, but you can also eat them while they're purple. And that's what we do. Uh, right, the other new additions to the greenhouse are the, let's cheat and read the label, the cherry tomatoes. And as you can see, getting some there, but we've got some black on the leaves as well. Not quite sure what that is. I'll have to look that up. But we've got plenty of tomatoes coming through on all of the cherries. Um, the... Come on, brain, kick in. My brain will kick in, I promise. Uh, no, these are all cherry tomatoes, you absolute moron. Right, so all the cherry tomatoes are doing really well. They're giving me fruit. The most exciting thing so far, though, as I bat a little bug off, um, whatever the smeg this is, and I can't remember what they are, I'm looking for a plant label. I'm normally good for putting at least one plant label in. Right, so these are the uh, sweet peppers, the uh, Bonita, Bonita. And we've actually got peppers, or and pepper on that one. There's a couple of small ones coming through on that one. Just, uh, just, just there. And a couple of small ones coming through on this one as well. Right, oh, you know, you know this has been eaten by a slug. No, it hasn't. <gasps> it hasn't been touched. Oh, my days. Please, please go yellow. Or red, even, in your case. If I pick them early, can I leave them on a windowsill to change colour? You know, like how you ripen a tomato and you, like, put it... I don't know what I'm talking about now. I may be just waffling. But, here we go. See a nice big one at the top there. Still loads of flowers on these as well, so... And it looks like the warm weather has discovered... OK, except for that one. Yeah, Some minor slug damage on that one. Um, let's check this one out. It doesn't... F I can't feel anything, which is a good sign. We we're all right with that. We're all right with that. All right, so there you go. That's what's going on in the greenhouse at the moment, anyway. Let me just step back a little bit. So, yeah, the greenhouse ain't doing too bad. Right, so, greenhouse has been done. So let's put the fox guard back on, even though I'm sure if the fox wanted to, he could just jump over this, but... That's it. We've got a fight with this. Now, hang on. Let's get him bloody there. Get... There you go. See, look. That, that would stop a Sherman tank. Probably. Maybe not, but hey ho. Right, what we're going to do, we're going to go over and grab a bucket. Preferably with a handle, because, you know... Oh, God! <gasps> oh, I've just seen something. We're going to grab one of these buckets, and I'm going to try and not be a giddy girl and get all excited over what I've just seen. Hopefully there's not too many spiders in these buckets, but everything will get washed when we get home anyway. Ow! I just dropped it on my toe and I'm wearing sliders. That's not funny. Okay, maybe it's a little bit funny. Right. 
Right. Let us grab some more tomatoes. And again, snapping them off at the knuckle. I don't know if that's a technical term, but literally, oh, let's try and do this so you can see what I'm doing. There's the knuckle where, where my th thumbnail is. And I'm just going to snap. They come off so easy. You don't have to worry about carrying a knife round with you or anything. Ooh, that one's really soft. About, oh, so all of the black Russians are coming with me today, I think. Let me rephrase that. All of the black Russians that are ready will be coming with me today because... Yeah, mm. Ooh, look at him. Ow. I'll just batter the camera. Right, he can come with. <laughs> Let's have a look at the end plant. Good. Squeezy, squeezy. Ooh, yep, he's soft. Snap him at the knuckle. Put him in the pot. Next one. Oh, he's really soft. Okay. I might have him tonight, to be fair. And this one, rock solid. Okay, so we'll leave him alone. See, tomatoes are easy plants. They really are. I'm trying to walk around very carefully because I am wearing fucking sliders. Don't know why I decided to wear sliders. That might be the best black Russian yet. Look at the colouring on that bad boy. All right, squeezy, squeezy. There's one hiding in there. Squeeze it. See, you thought if you hid behind your mates, but no. Ugh. Oh, right. Right, a few black Russians. Ah. Whew. Shall I, just for giggles, shall I grab a sweet corn? Just to see, because I do believe, and please correct me if I'm wrong, but once the stringy bits on the end of the sweet corn, let's put that down there, uh, start to die back, so they tend to look like that, so this wonderful specimen here, do you know what? It's not going to hurt, is it? <clears throat> Just take one. If it will come off, thank you. That's a, not a bad size. That'll be all right, I'm sure it will, he says, nearly smacking the camera off a pole. All right, he's going in the bucket. All right, let's start battering these ones, see? A little bit of squidge to it, it's coming home. That one wants to come home so badly it jumped off itself. Spiky plant, so ow, ow, ow. Oh yeah, it's super soft. And notice, by the way, that broke off at the knuckle. Oh, somebody loves me, I've got a text message. All right, squeeze, oh, oh yeah, come on. I can do this, I can. Squeezy, 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 squeezy. As long as there's a little giving them, they come home with me. Because that means they is ready. I'm sure I've already said that. Oh no, see, he's still got a bit of uh, a bit of substance about him. I've got a little one down here that's a bit squidgy, he can come home. Got a lovely dark one here. Oh yeah, he's definitely ready. One in here. Yeah, we'll leave him till next time. He's, he's got a bit of squidge to him, but nothing to write home about. I'll try this one here. Camera angle's all over the shop now. No, nope, he's rock bloody solid as well. Oh, let's come round this side without killing everything. Because they're trying to hide from me and I'm, I'm not happy. You're not allowed to hide from me when I'm trying to pick you. All right, just plonk you there for a minute while I check that bad boy out. Squeezy, squeeze. Oh, that's got a nice bounce to it, that has. Ready for? Come here, you. All right. Ha ha. That might be it. Four. Yeah, that's it for the Black Russians. Bit of a shame, really. All right, I'm going to walk around this way this time so that I don't damage anything else. So I've got a lovely collection of Black Russian in there. Um, you remember, I think it was the last video, I took a cucumber home with me? Look at that! See, he's almost, almost the length of my hand. That's handy, but let's pull him off there. I let him drop down a little bit. Has it grabbed on? Yes, it has. So it's doing what I want it to do. See how it's coming up, looping over at the top and starting to come back down again. That I actually want it to do that because all of this stuff on the bottom, when I've got a bit of time and I think it's going to be Sunday, 
um, I'm going to strip the bottom so that only the leaves at the top, the nice green leaves, the bright green leaves, um, they are the ones that are doing the photosynthesis at the moment. That was hard for me to say, I think I need new teeth. I don't see any more cucumbers, none that I can take seriously. Nope, so it's just that one there, and I think there's another one around the back there, and a little one coming right at the tip. What the smeg? Right, cabbage are doing good. I'm happy. I'm not even going to touch them. No flipping uh, cabbage butterfly in there. Little bugger. I still haven't figured out how you got in there. Right, what? oh, I need me pot. I'm walking away without me pot. Let's just give that a squeeze. Nope, okay. Now, you know, not allowed to squeeze anything else, am I? <clears throat> let's, let's keep it PG at least. Right, we'll come over to the Elsa Craig's and the Gardener's Delight, which are absolutely fucking phenomenal at the moment. Ugh. We are bringing home a lot of tomatoes. Oh yes we are, right, so you're coming home with me, you're not, you're not, you flipping well are, where's the top for you, one just fell off, why did you fall off, why did you fall off, you're rock bloody solid as well, he's rock solid, idiot, committing Harry Carry. right, so these are the gardener's delights that I'm picking now, and it's the same with all tomatoes, I, I give them a squeeze, if they're a bit squidgy, they come home. Look at the state of that. You're definitely coming home with me, my boy. Wow. That's insane. Is he? Yep, he can come home as well. A bumper crop is an absolute blinding one behind. These are the Elsa Craigs, by the way, the slightly bigger ones. So, uh, Gardener's Delight, Elsa Craigs. You can tell by their size. That one at the back there, ow. I'm not sure what just hurt me then, but something hurt my thumb. And my phone is definitely gonna go off. Bear with me a second, I need to check who this is. Right, sorry about that. Um, work. Uh, yes, I work. I don't just hide out and pretend that I know what I'm doing. Um, <laughs> I'm only coming around this side because there's a little fella here that I couldn't reach. Oh, and he's ready to come. Come on, then. You can come home with me. What about you? Nope. Solid as a bloody rock. Right, so there you go. I have another crop. What is going on? More importantly, sweet corn. Do you reckon I should... Shall I peel this sweet corn now before I disappear? It'd be rude not to, really, wouldn't it? Right, where can I set up the camera? Let's come up here. My allotment is an absolute pigsty at the moment as well. Right, bucket. Ah, tripod opening. <laughs> there we go. See, now I've got two hands. Two hands. So, shall we? Should we do this together? Da, da, da. Da, 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 da. Yeah, okay, let's just, let's just get through it, eh? You don't need to be silly. Oh, help if I actually... There we go. Um, it's been a while since I've released sweet corn from its cocoon. I'm so excited. And I just can't... Stop singing. Right. Oh, do you see what I see? We have sweet corn. We ha we've only bloody grown sweet corn. Yeah, I'll probably put. Come on, come on. We want to see the whole co the whole cob. That's you know what, that's close enough for council work now. Come on, right. <laughs> I grew sweet corn. Okay, the bit the end's a bit nasty, but that's sweet corn. I'm happy with that. Guess where that? Guess where that's going? Bucket. So there we go. Another successful harvest. Everything in the greenhouse has been watered. 
The only thing left now is to go home. Cabbages looking good, sprouts are looking good. So let's go. Hang on a minute, we've got to do this. <laughs> that makes sense. It did in my head anyway, I don't know. So yeah. Oh god, look at that, nearly left me bloody vape. Oh definitely can't afford to be doing that. So ooh, that's it. I've got a crop. More to the point, I've got sweet corn. I've got bloody sweet corn. I'm a little bit happy about that. Right, hopefully you like the video guys. I'm going to go home in a very good mood now and cook, which will probably put me in a bit of a worse mood, but it's all right. Uh, yeah, hopefully you like videos. Videos? I think I need a cool shower is what it is. I need to bring my temperature down and stop being so bloody hyper. So until the next video guys, take care all. Bye bye now.